Aloha, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. My name is Master Paul. It is my great honor to be with you here today in the year 2017. Today is January 2nd of 2017, and we are embarking on a new journey. I'm very excited about the opportunity to serve you here today. Um, it is the 15th day of 21 days of healing ourselves through service to others. And I was reviewing some of the past videos and some of the past comments on this. And you know, it, it really makes me feel um, um, grateful in so many ways in this last uh, uh, 15 days because we've all done our own level of healing according to whatever we were willing to put into this practice. And even just by being present, there's so much purification that is occurring. There was a lot of purification that occurred for that has occurred and may still be occurring for many of the souls um, in the holiday season. Even myself went through a little bit of purification, uh, and you know I just do what I teach, which is to practice and to chant, and uh, I also have to do what's called calligraphy, drawing, and tracing, so it all helps. Um, but. This weekend obviously was a big weekend for a lot of us. We had the New Year's, New Year's Eve weekend coming back off of it. Uh, at least here in Hawaii, it's not a scheduled holiday, but everyone takes the day off anyway. The banks are closed, all the governments are closed. Uh, pretty much everything in Hawaii, they love their vacations here. So I guess that's why people like to come here. But uh, it's been a good thing overall. Um, so I want to check in with all those who are joining us today. <clears throat> so welcome, Teresa Brown. Welcome, Liz. Happy New Year. Welcome, CJ. Welcome, Dana. Welcome, Shari. Good to see you, Ali. Welcome, uh, Cheryl Healing Ray. And welcome also, Chrissy Kota. Welcome, Johannes. Welcome, Tammy. And welcome Linda, welcome Ilona. There's uh, more that are here than ha I can see the names of. And uh, so welcome to all of you as your names pop up. I'll acknowledge you. Happy New Year to all of you. I hope, I hope that all of your New Year's has started out with a, a good um, flavor to it. Um, there's always opportunity to transform our blockages and the new year is one of the best ways to do that. I did notice myself with more energy. I noticed myself more um, intention and the ability to follow through on that intention. Uh, for myself, I noticed that I get kind of lethargic in my um, follow through. Uh, typically that happens for me about a week before the holiday, a week before Christmas and uh, sometimes a little bit after it. This time it held all the way into the new year. But today woke up feeling a lot better, a lot more energized and a lot more focused and the ability to follow through. So let me know how your New Year's is shaping up. Did you make your resolutions? Are you starting to follow through on those? Uh, earlier today I offered a healing blessing for those who have joined my my twice a month uh, healing uh, program. It's very nominal. It's only $30 and you get two big, big, big blessings a month. Anyway, that was this morning. So I offered that blessing and then what I did is I went up on top of one of the local hills here and overlooked Diamond Head Mountain and overlooked the ocean. <clears throat> and what I noticed was uh, there was a lot of people running uh, up the, the, the grade, if you will, because it was a residential grade. And um, I saw one young woman, she ran up and down it like three or four times. Like she would go up, I don't know, two or three blocks, she'd come back down and do it again. So a lot of people following through with their resolutions. I was kind of laughing inside saying, you know, if, if, if I and everybody else could actually follow through with these intentions, we could do very, very well this year. Welcome Nina, welcome Sherry Dowell, welcome Judas, welcome Pat, welcome Kristen Rojas. And Sherry says she's been sick all week. Well, hopefully this will give you a little boost, jump you out of that condition. Welcome, Yvonne. And welcome, Scott. Welcome, Pamela. So today, day 15 of 21 days of serving others. Now, I want to start by giving you a little heads up 
on the 12th of this month, Love Peace Harmony Center Honolulu will be doing an official Become Happier, Healthier, Younger 21 Day Challenge. What do I mean by official? Well, if you go to the Love Peace Harmony Center Honolulu's Facebook page, uh, you'll see that uh, there and you'll see all of the different aspects to it. It includes the opportunity for the winner. They've done this twice already. The winner will receive a beautiful da eye calligraphy. It's at least a $500 value. They'll receive a half hour soul, soul uh, readings. They'll receive blessings. Um, lots and lots of blessings. It, uh, it's well over a thousand dollars worth of value for the grand prize winner. And, and uh, uh, there's a very, very small honor fee to be a part of this uh, uh, official 21 day happier, healthier, younger challenge. Uh, some of you might have already taken advantage of the previous two that they had done. Uh, everybody comments about the huge benefits for them. It is significantly different than what we've been doing because ours is not official and I don't have these huge prizes and all that. But um, when you do it in a structured format, such as the, the Love Peace Harmony Center Honolulu, obviously there's going to be huge, huge, huge blessings because you have Master Shah's Tao Healing Center. You have uh, Master Arlena, Master Patrick, Master Jimena. And the kickoff to that is Thursday, uh, the 5th. So you can register for that right away. <clears throat> Again, if you go to Love Peace Harmony uh, Center's Facebook page, uh, I believe that's the main banner that they show. And it'll uh, just look for the registration. So anyway, also welcome to Tracy. Welcome um, and thank you, Kristen, for placing those links. And thanks for commenting, Cheryl, about yes, you're getting some of your intentions followed through. So let us connect heart to heart, soul to soul, placing our hands in soul light, soul service, hand position, dropping our left hand in front of our heart center, bringing our right hand, gently pointing it towards heaven. Take a deep breath in. Release the day. Be fully present. Take another deep breath in. It may be the beginning of your day. Be fully present. There are all layers of the divine, the Tao, and the source. All beings serving the plan of the light side, including the light side planets, stars, galaxies, and universes. All beings of light, angels, healing, archangels, all masters, ascended masters, lamas, sifus, gurus, saints, kahunas, their beloved Buddhas and bodhisattvas. We love you, honor you, respect you, and I bow down to you. We invite our individual heavens, teams, guides, angels, and saints that have been assigned to us in this and all lifetimes. We invite them to please come at this time. We are beyond grateful for your presence. To the soul of all the uh, treasures, downloads, treasures, calligraphy blessings, and the Kaigong blessings in this room and in my painting behind me. We love you, honor you, appreciate you. We ask you to be present at this time as well. And as we chant to serve humanity and all souls, as we chant to, um, to release our own blockages, we ask in whatever way is most appropriate that you please be present. Dear the source soul song of love, peace, and harmony, transmitted to all souls in all universes. We love you, honor you, appreciate you, respect you. We ask you to please turn on. <clears throat> and we invite all souls to join us as we chant to connect hearts and hearts, souls to souls. And I ask and invite all the souls that are watching today to please hit the share button, let others know about us. And welcome Stephanie, welcome Tracy, welcome Carol. So let us chant for a couple of rounds as we fully connect. Lula, Lula, Lee. Lula, Lula, la, Lee. Lula, Lula, li, Lula, Lula, li, Lula, Lula, li, Lula, 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 Shuang I ping on a she, Shuang I ping on a she. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. 
of peace and harmony, love, peace and harmony. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, la, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. Why? Washing Erling, I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace and harmony. Love, peace and harmony. How, 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 thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Divine Down Source. Thank you to all the holy beings that have come to offer your service along with all of us at this time. We have invited the souls of stars, planets, galaxies, and universes. They have souls, and they didn't get to be that way by accident. The uh, planet, you know, look at Mother Earth. Mother Earth has lived at least four billion years. Human beings, about a hundred. And then we do it again and then we do it again and yet all of these beings they still have a soul journey and they are still uh, uh, moving higher in their soul journey you look at mother earth her love her service is the epitome of unconditional love and service there is never a moment she is not offering us her unconditional love and service and that's why she has so far a four billion uh, lifespan and so <clears throat> you know, one of Dr. and Master Shaw's foundational teachings is uh, heal the soul first and the mind and body will follow. How do we heal the soul first? We heal it by offering service to others. How do we do that? By making others happier and healthier. What's the easiest and best way to make others happier and healthier? Smiling, of course, that helps. But chanting love, peace and harmony is a huge aspect of that. When we chant love, peace, and harmony, we're bringing a very high frequency. Why is that important? And what does that do for us in a generalized sense? What's happening is one of Master Shah's teachings is in order to reach enlightenment, we must transform our Shen, Qi, and Jing. Transform, to change, to alter, to make uh, uh, one way or the other higher or lower, in this case, higher. So how do we alter our Shen, Qi, and Jing? Remember, Shen is soul, Qi is energy, Jing is matter. How do we transform our soul, energy, and matter? We transform them with higher soul, energy, and matter. Who and what has higher soul, energy, and matter? How about Kuan Yin? How about Happy Buddha? How about Jesus? How about Mother Mary? Do they have higher soul, energy, and matter? Yes. How about Mother Earth? She's lived four billion years. She is an unconditional universal servant. Isn't her Shen, Qi, and Jing higher? The answer is absolutely yes. What about heaven? Heaven's lived longer than Mother Earth. Heaven's Shen, Qi, and Jing are higher. There is ancient wisdom and teachings that refers to what's called the Tao. Now the Tao is not a religion. Taoism is a religion, but the Tao has nothing to do with religion. The Tao is a philosophy. The Tao is an understanding. And the Tao states that everything came from one, and from one became two. What is two? Two is heaven and earth. So from the heart of Creator came heaven and earth. Heaven and earth then are the, the mother and father, the, the yin and the yang, if you will. And from them is born three. From one becomes two, from two becomes three. What is three? Three is the human being. 
okay? So how do we return back to the source? We return by utilizing the Shen Qi and Jing of Mother Earth and of Heaven. They have a much higher frequency. They have a much purer heart. They have, they have many, many layers of purity higher than the human being. And so each time we connect like this, each time we chant unconditionally to serve Mother Earth, to serve those in Heaven, to serve any souls anywhere, when we serve, we are elevating our frequency to theirs. When we ask them to come and serve, like we did in the beginning, we ask Mother Earth, Heaven, Tao, Source to come to serve. They have come. They are with us now. They are serving along with us. And part of that service is they're showering their virtue, their Shen, Qi, and Jing upon us. That virtue uplifts our soul's standing. Their virtue blesses us to clear some of our spiritual debt, our karma. And as a result, our Shen Qi and Jing becomes purer, more light, more crystalline, if you will. We are moving closer to the divine. We are moving closer to Mother Earth's Shen Qi and Jing, to their frequency. And we are moving closer to original creator. Original Creator goes by many names. Some call it Source, some say the Tao, some say Creator. You know, the name is it, it just, if you focus on the name, you're lost already. The key is we want to transform our Shen, Qi, and Jing to the highest frequency possible. We we'll do that by mimicking, by following the path of those before us that have reached higher and higher levels. Why do you think I follow a teacher like Dr. and Master Sha? Do you think I'm just a no brain that I, I just follow ambiguously because I'm just, oh, I want to follow somebody? No, I'm following a teacher that has laid out a pathway to enlightenment. He says, look, follow me, follow anybody. I don't care who you follow. I have no attachment. I'm just giving you a way that will take you back to the creator based on common sense understandings. Open your heart, open your spiritual channels, follow a path. So whatever path you follow, if it's bringing you to happier, uh, happier conditions, higher conditions, uh, is, if it, is it's bringing you to a place where you are purifying and you're getting better and better and better, then stay on that path. But if it's not, consider going to a path that is. And so that's the reason why I'm here teaching you today, because that is my form of unconditional service. Mother Earth, she brings us air. She brings us water. She brings us a beautiful ground to walk upon. She brings us the incredible treasures that nature offers us. And she brings it with an unconditional love. So she is, I'm also willing to follow her. I'm willing to follow heaven. Heaven brings us the guides, angels, and saints. They bring us the higher purity. Heaven brings us help all the time around every corner. Help is there. But most of us don't connect with heaven because we can't see heaven like we can see Mother Earth. We connect when we're, on, when we're suffering. We only connect when we're lost. We need to learn to connect all the time. This is one of the teachings Dr. Master Shah has brought to us. Heal the soul first and the mind and body will follow. Say hello through the four powers. The four powers, body power, mind power, sound power. We already know all that. Soul power is the fourth power. Why do we do soul power? Because we're connecting with Mother Earth and Heaven, Tao and Source. When we connect with the heavenly world, they shower us with their higher frequencies, their higher Shen, Qi, and Jing. We must learn to connect with them with every breath, with every thought, word, and action. The more we connect with these higher frequencies, with these higher uh, um, uh, Shen, Qi, and Jing, the more we transform our blockages, the more we look to them when we have a problem and when things are good. Both gratitude in the bad things and gratitude in the good things. When we start to shift our perspectives that heaven is always with us, in us, around us, never separate from us, then we start to truly transform our blockages. That's why I'm here. That's why you're here. That's probably the reason you continue to come back. For some reason, at the end of each time I do a one hour service, you feel better. That's not because of Paul. That's because of the frequency. That's because of the Shen, Qi, and Jing of the soul power that has been asked to come forth. You can do the exact same things. 
any of the practices that I offer, any of the transmissions that I offer, any of the practices we do from Dr. Master Shah's book. They all serve the same purpose, to transform our Shen, Qi, and Jing. I, um, I was cleaning out a friend's locker and she had a bunch of extra books. And one of the books was from an author that teaches about John of God. John of God is a servant. He, he helps people to heal. Um, he doesn't claim any of it. He says it's the divine working through him. And so these were books. I actually have never read the book. I just know of this man. I know he's serving. And I had these extra ones. And so I put two of them out at the apartment complex that I'm at. And they sat there for a few days. One eventually got taken. And the other one I found ripped in half. What is that? That is a soul that immediately felt hurt and they immediately felt um, um, really, really like this is the devil. It's very unfortunate. I had to ask for forgiveness from for that soul because they know not what they do. If they just said, this doesn't serve my soul journey, but it may serve somebody else's. My belief system is my belief system and it serves me, but it may not serve other people's. This is unconditionalness. There are so many that we need to be able to open their hearts that if they don't agree where you're at on your soul journey, we don't defend. We don't uh, do negative about wherever they're at. We simply honor where they're at and ask them to honor where we're at. So I bring this up just as a part of this new year because as we move forward in this new year, the highest and best that we can do for ourselves is to expand our soul journey. And we have been given the tools to accomplish that. We are very, very blessed to have beloved Jesus who brought the Bible, to have Buddha that brought all the Buddhist teachings, to have Krishna that brought all the teachings of the Quran and so forth. These various teachings serve in such a powerful way. Dr. Master Shah's wisdom and teachings teach the same that all of these do. Love, forgiveness, compassion, light. Same teachings, different verbiage. The one unique difference that I really love about Dr. Master Shah's wisdom and his teachings is that he has brought also into his books and his music the additional frequencies from heaven. Very, very high frequencies that when we employ them, they can literally transform blockages hundreds and thousands of times faster than without those frequencies. So we will serve today. We will serve Mother Earth. We will serve today. We will serve heaven. We're going to chant 10 minutes for each of them. Now, this 15 days, you have been choosing a very specific uh, organ or system or health condition, emotional condition, financial condition. You've hopefully chosen that one condition that you've chosen to stick with for these entire uh, uh, 14 or so days that we've been doing this so far. And we, we've asked those conditions, the conditions of, let's say, depression, as an example. Dear the condition of the depression that I have been dealing with. All of the souls that are in my body associated with this condition of depression. It could be neck pain, whatever. I love you. Please chant to serve others. That's how we have been doing this. <clears throat> We're still doing that. We're just asking them to serve Mother Earth. We're asking them to serve the oceans, which we did last Friday. And today we'll ask them to serve Mother Earth and we'll ask them to serve Heaven. And because heaven serves us unconditionally, let's serve heaven also. Mother Earth serves us unconditionally. Let's give her our love and gratitude also. And in this way, we are serving others. Naturally, we will receive virtue as our service and that will help us to offset our uh, blockages, okay? So let us serve. <clears throat> First, we will do a forgiveness practice with heaven and with Mother Earth because that forgiveness and love permeates every teaching of every spiritual mother and father in all life. Every true spiritual mother and father teaches love and forgiveness. So we always do that. So let us begin. Placing our hands in soul light, soul surface, hand position. Left hand in front of the heart center, right hand gently pointed towards heaven. Close your eyes. If you are comfortable, please do this forgiveness practice with me. Please repeat. <coughs> Dear all layers, 
of the divine, the Tao, the source, up to original creator, all of the holy beings that are present, dear beloved Mother Earth, dear all of those in heaven, all heaven's generals and soldiers, all those that work at the Akashic Records levels, dear all of my individual heaven's teams, guides, angels, and saints from all lifetimes, dear all archangels, healing angels, Lamas, Sifus, Gurus, Saints, Kahunas, Masters and Ascendant Masters. Dear the soul of all of the souls of all stars, suns, planets, galaxies, universes. I love you. Please forgive me for this lifetime or any lifetime that I have not acknowledged your service to me, my loved ones, and my ancestors please forgive me for this in all lifetimes that i have not been appreciative or grateful that i have taken credit for any of the things that actually you were responsible for please forgive me for my ego my lack of alignment my lack of respect my lack of gratitude for all that you have ever done to serve me on my soul journey. Please forgive me my lack of focus and meditation. Please forgive me my lack of connecting to you as much as I possibly could have. Please forgive me for this in any lifetime that you have offered blessings when I have requested and I have not offered appropriate or deep enough gratitude and appreciation for what you have done for me. Please forgive me for you saving my life certainly more than once and my complete lack of awareness of this or lack of gratitude or appreciation for you saving my life. I truly and sincerely apologize for any conscious or unconscious ignorance to your presence, to your love, to your forgiveness. Please forgive me for not acknowledging you and your incredible and unconditional service to me, my loved ones, and my ancestors. I wish to chant on your behalf today in the deepest gratitude for all that you do for me, beloved heaven, beloved all the holy beings, all the stars, planets, galaxies, and universes. I wish to chant on your behalf and I invite all souls in all universes to chant with me to serve you at this time and so as we chant to serve heaven and all the holy beings that have ever served unconditionally offer your greatest love and gratitude in return let us chant together one more thing repeat after me do the soul of my condition please state that your condition if you've been doing the 21 days state the same condition all of the souls involved in this condition of state that what it is I love you please chant with me love peace and harmony to serve all those in heaven at this time thank you thank you thank you and we always say as appropriate okay as appropriate let us chant together sending our greatest love Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin er ling Wo ai chuan ren lei 
王陵容儿暮时上，相爱平安和谐，相爱平安和谐。I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. <coughs> lu la lu la li. Lu la lu la la li. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin er ling, wo ai tran ren li. Wang Ling Rong Er Mu Shi Shang, Shuang Ai Ping An He Xie, Shuang Ai Ping An He Xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls. Together, love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. See heaven and Mother Earth chanting together. Billions upon trillions upon trillions of saints chanting with you in gratitude. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, la, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin er ling, wo ai tran ren li, wang ling rong er mu shi shang, xuang ai ping an he xie, xuang ai ping an he xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Lu la lu la li, lu la lu la la li, lu la lu la li lu la, lu la li lu la, lu la li lu la. Wo ai wo xin er ling, wo ai tran ren li, wang ling rong er mu shi shang, xiang ai ping an he xie, xiang ai ping an he xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. 
love, peace, and harmony. Continue to do this forgiveness practice with me. Dear the soul of Mother Earth, I love you so much with all my heart. I cannot thank you enough in all my lifetimes for all that you have ever done for me. Dear the soul of the trees of Mother Earth, of all of the plant life of Mother Earth, you have breathed in my carbon dioxide and brought me life with your oxygen. The soul of the plankton of Mother Earth's oceans, I thank you too, for you have been the second most abundant source of the oxygen that has allowed me to breathe. Without both of you, I could not live. Thank you for your unconditional service to me. Please forgive me for all harm in this and all lifetimes that I, my ancestors, and humanity has done to harm you and your existence. Please forgive us for cutting you down heartlessly. Please forgive us for polluting your waters and your very livelihood. Please forgive us for the pollution of the air and the water that has clogged your ability to transform the carbon dioxide to our life-giving oxygen. Please forgive our incredible greed and ignorance, our incredible lack of awareness. We ask that you please chant with us to awaken humanity, that we might all work in harmonious ways to love each other and to serve each other in the most unconditional and harmonious service. Dear the souls of all the plant life, the flowers, the waterways, of Mother Earth, the drinking water throughout all of the veins of the rivers of Mother Earth. Please forgive me, my ancestors and humanity, for tainting your purity with not only our actions, but with our thoughts and our words. We have become intelligent enough to know that thoughts and words change your frequency, your healing and serving abilities, and yet we have not taken responsibility. Please forgive me, my ancestors and humanity, for our disrespect, our lack of love, our lack of thoughtfulness. We will continue to chant and we invite all the souls of Mother Earth, of the waterways, of the air and of the plant life, of the mountains and the streams. We invite the souls of all of the animals, the birds and the species in the oceans to chant with us at this time. Let us continue with all of our heart. Lula, lula, li. Pay attention to any third eye images you might receive. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin her ling Wo ai tron ran li Wang li rung her mu shi shang Shuang ai ping on a she Shuang ai ping on a she 
I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace and harmony. Love, peace and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin er ling, wo ai truan ren li, wang li ying rong er mu shi shang, shuang ai ping an er xie, shuang ai ping an er xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin er ling, wo ai truan ren li, wang li hing rong er mu shi shang, shuang ai ping an er xie, shuang ai ping an er xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Hello, Hawaiian. Hello, Hawaii. Hello, Hakako. Happy Hili Mai. Puvai Kakao. Aloha, Malielo Kahi. Aloha, Malielo Kahi. One more round. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Woi, woshin. Woi, truan ren li, wang li ying rong er mu shi shang, shuang ai ping an er xie, shuang ai ping an er xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. 
please stay in this relaxed space and I will offer a soul reading as to what transpired during this last 20 minutes of chanting and forgiveness. Dear Heaven, Tao, and Source, Mother Earth, please choose a spokesperson, borrow my mouth, offer whatever is relevant and important for all to hear at this time. How? This is your beloved divine speaking on behalf of all creation that has come forth and has both given and received blessings. When there was a calling made to serve the heavenly realms, there was a startling effect. There has been such little of this awareness on the earth planes at the level of the normal human activity. This kind of awareness and teaching is indeed a very high level teaching that is known by most of the initiates of the highest ranks. This one speaking on my behalf knew not of this information until he spoke it and called you forth to serve in this way. There was an interesting domino effect as although this information seems somewhat obvious, there are those in the first and second and some in the third layers of the saints in the heavenly realms that do not chant to serve those higher than them. They too were awakened to this calling those higher of course know this wisdom and in fact they instantly offered all virtue that was rising up to them because of this service to their creator they instantly said please i offer all virtue from this and all time to my beloved creator this too is some of the highest wisdom because those who offer it back to the Creator fulfill the circle of life. It is of the greatest and highest importance that the base wisdom service goes through to the top and then continues to uplift more, be understood. Each of you serving today offered your full and unconditional heart. There was not one that was not fully present and offering your greatest gratitude. And because of this, there were lifetimes of virtue showered upon all of your Akashic records. There were several lives saved on this day from events that would have occurred within the next few months. There were 21 of you whose soul journey was saved in which there would have been a questioning of your path within the next three years this kind of virtue is not easily given but because of your unconditional service heaven has responded with the greatest of gratitude it is my encouragement that you remember this deep wisdom and to chant every day in this circle of life for three returns to two returns to one. A one becomes two becomes three returns to two returns to one. This is Tao creation and reverse creation and this is the secret of all life. I am deeply honored to have been present and along with you serving in this most important task. This is your beloved divine. How, how, how. Thank you, thank you, thank you, beloved divine for that most incredible message. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Twice, twice, very heart opening, twice I 
holding back tears. Beautiful. Thank you all for your unconditional service at this time. Very heart opening. Very big blessings. Check in with yourself. How are you feeling at this time? What have you noticed? Is your heart open? Did the stress you come in with leave you? Did the pain you come in with diminish or leave you entirely? Where are you now versus at the beginning of this chanting and service for others unconditionally? It is of the greatest importance to remember this great wisdom that the divine has brought to us through this service here today. And again, I bring you back to this is uh, able, I'm able to serve you because of Dr. Master Shah teaching me what I have just shared with you. And so if it resonates with you, learn more about this most benevolent soul, drsha.com, www.drsha.com. Uh, for those that are newer that have just come in, the soul song we were singing, uh, Kristen, a uh, beautiful unconditional servant, has posted many links that you can follow through on. For those that did not hear at the beginning of this program, uh, there is a 21-day happier, healthier, younger challenge that is a, a, like a, a, the version of what we have been doing a much, much bigger, purer, and more powerful form. And the... Um, the um, preliminary initiation of that is this Thursday, the 5th, and then they will actually release the full boat version of it on the 12th of uh, January. So I encourage you to come to the live stream, the online, uh, go, go to drshaw.com. Kristen has made some posts on that, so look through them, and you'll see the registration link for that for this coming Thursday at Master Shaw's Dow Healing Center. It is a complimentary. You just register and go to the links that you'll get in your email. And then the following week for the actual full vote, vote version, um, you'll have your own personal mentor. There's huge thousand dollars worth of prizes. It's a great opportunity to really choose that, that one thing you really wanna uh, do special blessings with and special clearings with and really have a devoted task towards that end. And so uh, uh, if you have more questions about that, you can contact me. Again, um, there is uh, the blessings available for your new years. If you're having trouble getting over that hump and whatever the issue is, I'm happy to offer you soul reading, crown chakra blessing, whatever you might need. You can contact me through uh, 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 Skype, through the Facebook chat, all these different ways of, of contacting me. And of course, my website, asoulhealer.com. Uh, so... Tomorrow will be day 16 as we move for, forward to the 21, complete the 21 days of healing yourself through service to others. I would like to uh, see if any of you are starting to notice now that we're in the day 15 of what you have requested. Is there any significant transformation? I know Nina just said she's feeling better now as she's used these practices to transform the blockages with her loved one, her turtle. Uh, I see Dvorka has joined us and her daughter. Uh, Teresa says, I burst into tears and seeing the Native Americans with tears running down their faces. Yeah, I tell you, we had so many big souls joining us. Huge, huge service today, connecting with heaven. Uh, Nina, thank you for your sharing. She also said, uh, Teresa said she also got warm, uh, felt heat running through her. Yeah, if it wasn't for this fan directly on me, I mean, I would have been just a sweat box here. Uh, Christy says, thank you. You're very welcome, Christy. CJ, wow. Here da, da I voices around. Beautiful, so calm, so vast. Lights covering Mother Earth. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So wonderful. I tell you, that forgiveness practice we did with Heaven and with Mother Earth, very big, very, very big forgiveness practice. I encourage you to do that once in a while uh, to just connect. And a little secret, always call all souls to do the forgiveness practice with you because there may be many many souls of humanity that come and do that forgiveness practice with you for mother earth for all of the holy beings that have been serving us unconditionally when we uh, uh, don't um, don't have any differences and so when we work with these uh, practices of love and forgiveness that permeates all of the true teachings throughout all life then we can definitely make differences in our life. So I see um, that, let's see, 
Thanks for sharing. I appreciate that update, Joanne. Dean says, lots of heat around heart. Thank you. Cheryl says, thank you. Yes, very big blessings. Cried three times and felt the presence of the highest souls. Saw pure energy of light coming out of the mouth of all who was chanting. And so beautiful, so humbled. And uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Seeing great improvement in the condition that she has been chanting for. Wonderful. Shadow, I saw her superimposed over you and a few times while you were chanting. It was beautiful. I'm guessing you're speaking of Kuan Yin, uh, our, our Mother Mary, or possibly Mother Earth. I'm not sure. But thanks for your sharing, Sha. Um, so let us call it a day. Uh, tomorrow I will be back. We will move into day 16 of healing ourselves through service to others. And if you have any ideas of who we can call forth to serve with us, who we can chant for, special conditions that we can chant for, absolutely, I'm happy to offer that service. And thank you also for your sharing, Crystal. Very beautiful sharing. Thank you. So let us say together to heaven, we love you, heaven. Love you, Source. Love you, the Tao. Love you, Creator. Love you, all the holy beings, guides, angels, saints, healing angels, archangels, Lama Sifus, Gurus, Kahunas. We love you, Krishna. We love you, all Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. We love you, all the beings of light, side, stars, planets, galaxies, and universes. We thank you for your unconditional service here today. We love you, Mother Earth, all the inhabitants of Mother Earth, stars, excuse me, all, all, all the water, all the trees, plant life, everyone. Love you, love you, love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gong song, gong song, gong song. We'll see you all tomorrow. Remember to share. If you're new, please hit the subscribe button after I post this video in a few minutes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Bye-bye, everybody.